Fellow Sierra Leoneans, this na Dr. Sylvia Olainka Blyden and today 1st of May 2021. This na mi 29th audio in mi ongoing series of address to the people of Sierra Leone. So this na audio 029. And as I mean promise na inside audio 028. Today we can talk something about the APC current constitution. But before we reach yonder, I want to discuss small bit about detention, arrests, illegal arrests, we properly referred to as kidnaps. Today, May 1st, 2021, it mark exactly one year from where this government send for can kidnap Minami House on May 1st, 2020. Exactly one year ago, nine this government kidnapped me from my house. Make I use this opportunity today, exactly one year after, for say thank you to una all women agitate for me that day. Within 24 hours, the entire social media, everybody may they agitate, free Dr. Blyden, free Dr. Blyden, use me photograph as them profile picture, go on Facebook, go on WhatsApp. I want to tell you now, thank you. Special thank you to the one that we, even after this government, me don't make like for saying so fearful, fearful crime I commit, they make they arrest me, or as I could correctly say, we make them kidnap me. Those people still stood by me. They believed in me and they refused for accept say na bad thing I do. So them particular people then they make a tell on a special thank you today. On a sabu on a self, on a stick on a neck out for me. Some of on a challenge even on a young family members them for me sake. On a sabu on a self. Thank you. To all the rest of Una, some of Una will not ever know me, but when me they pray for me, when they can kidnap me one year ago, where I not do nothing, just can kidnap me and meals. I tell Una, oh, thank you for the prayers. Let God bless we all. And let God judge we all. According to high for judge everybody. Now, my people, them, I don't repeatedly say I was kidnapped. I was not arrested. And today, make I take the opportunity for make una understand, say, even police, the kidnapped person. Because then get procedure by which you they arrest somebody legally. If you're a policeman, you not follow that procedure. When are you supposed for use for arrest somebody? Then I am sorry not to arrest you, arrest the person. Na kidnap, you kidnap the person. Because an unlawful arrest is a kidnap. An arrest will not follow legal procedure, na kidnap. 
For example, something happened in Desia Nabo. Then they know to arrest. Then they not kidnap. Waiting happened to myself one year ago. Not to arrest. Not kidnap. And make a use today for explain to owner for understand waiting at the correct procedure where if policeman not follow that procedure day, it is not a lawful arrest. One, you only the lawfully arrest somebody if you tell them what to make you the arrest them at the time where you the arrest them. You know, just the car you get up on somebody say, car wants you in a station. Car, car go wants you in a station. You begin bond to the person by force, the car and go. No. The law very clear. Then get a law where they call the Criminal Procedure Act, where they been passed in 1965. And the Criminal Procedure Act of 1965 is very clear. Under section 15, he say, when you arrest somebody, you for immediately inform the person about why make you the arrest them. The cause will make you the arrest them. You can arrest person like you not get arrest warrant. But when you they arrest the person, you foretell them. Say now so so and so easy make I don't put you under arrest. You not just they go na somebody in house, like a waiting and do that young man a boo. Get her a half naked. Bundle inside motoka. Drive off recklessly. Then you see that in an arrest. That is not an arrest. That is a kidnap. In fact, the law under the Criminal Procedure Act, it even they warn you and caution you, the police or the arresting official. Say you not for use any more restraint than is needed. So if you see you pass the mark, like a waiting and do that young man, they so half naked, bondula, restrain them. You don't pass the mark, you self don't commit crime. So when are they use the word kidnap? Now waiting and do me last year. Now kidnap. Me people them I go spend time explaining to na one time in the future. But today I just give you a short summary of what happened exactly one year ago. When them people here don't kidnap me because they not tell me why may they arrest me. In fact, the whole country. For four days, then they ask why on all this woman. They're not able to explain nothing because there's no reason to give. Now others from above say, "Gonna go get her." Then self the policeman and follow others from above. They're not the reason why them for all me or then just can and get at me. Then go put me in a cell. Then in a kidnap. But what it happened that day? day you they actually see say. This was just an effort for intimidate and terrorize somebody. When I reached the female cells, there may get five women already in detention, including the poor wife of a comrade Palo Conte, Amit and four other women. They pulled them all out of the female cells. They left me one for go inside. Then they bring five man them, five from Padamba Road Prison. When they bring, I said they laugh. They tell me, "Oh, you see that man there? That is a rapist. You see this one? He don't kill a person. You see this is a murderer. This is a convict. This is a hardcore criminal." They put them inside the female cells. Then they pull all the women they do. Then they put me inside now, and the cell with the next to inside the man then they. Inside the female cells, the, the cell outside man then they then put me next day. Then pull all the other women they outside. Then can put outside breeze day. And they then sleep till the next morning. Me they left me one inside day. 
Then they allow me say make a send go take pillow na me os because there's not only pillow I go able send. When me driver and me assistant then come with the pillow, as then give me the pillow say say make a because I grown a little but I say me neck I go need pillow. As then give me the pillow so when they come put them, now they arrest me driver, they arrest me personal assistant. They arrest me, Motuka. All of this on May 1st for terrorize me no more. This is what this government did on May 1st last year. So they lock up my driver, na the mail cells, they lock up my personal assistant. For no reason, oh. They will send tell and say, let them bring pillow come for me. Then they take the pillow back again. Then say, me not for sleep on the pillow. The pillow na exhibits for charge my driver to court. <laughs> <laughs> so they terrorize all my staff them. Then they begin call me staff them now on the phone. So anybody now where they work for me, all my begin scared, they won't go hide. Because also they don't arrest my personal assistant, put on a cell. They don't arrest my driver, put on a cell. Then me say they don't put myself in a cell on the same evening. All my scared, saying that some fearful thing they go on. Then they send policeman and come down to my house. My neighbor, they all, then they feel like some fearful, fearful something I mean do. And throughout this process, they don't ever arrest me according to law. Because the law very clear say when you arrest somebody, you foretell them why you arrest them. This is the Criminal Procedure Act of 1965, Section 15. Secondly, even the Sierra Leone Constitution of 1991, Section 17, back make them very clear. Say, if you de arrest somebody, you for make sure, say, you tell them at the time when they arrest them, why make you arrest them? Me. Nobody not tell me. Then just bond me go put me in a cell. There was no reason. Now, after three days, we are done in a cell. Three days. On the third day, now the director of criminal services, AIG Brahimaja. When he come up on, this is May 3rd now, on the third day, me not ever sabiam, that, that did they force me sabiam. So when he come up, he can ask for Dr. Blyden, they come and pull me out of the cell. Now I tell him, say, if you are aware, say, three days now I've been kidnapped, I've not yet been arrested. Now that's in the, because in a clever police officer, so he's shocked. He said, hey, nobody not arrested. I said, no, I've not been arrested. I said, for three days now, I'm under kidnapped by your officers. Now that tender he call one woman now, one female police officer, he show the person now because there is a procedure by which you arrest somebody. If you touch the person now in the shoulder, where you arrest her, you tell them why you arrest them. So imagine, oh, now on the third day, now in the formally, now AIG Brahma just supervised the arrest. So I was kidnapped and not arrested. Until the third day, now they arrest me. Nothing they can talk now, say, you are under arrest for seditious libel, defamatory libel of His Excellency the President. Nothing they can tell me. <laughs> well, they don't sweat, sweat, stay, they don't have buffet, no nothing for linking me up with any kind of bad. And they arrest me now after three days. So, my people, when I learn this today, policeman, no get a right for arrest you if he not tell you. What he make it they arrest you? You know, just that you bundle somebody, you say, can't go to the station, can't go to the station. No. At the point where they arrest you, for tell them, what he don't do? What are the circumstances of what he don't do? Otherwise, na an illegal arrest, and it is a kidnap. I just say, make and make them declare, especially in light of the kind of kidnap who see them go kidnap that young man a bo then this year. Now let we come to today's uh, topic. I mean, don't tell us say we can't discuss the 
APC constitution. And I hope say some of you get the constitution by on our side. You see, so many people may surprised at what I reveal about Chaka Stevens and how patriotic a man he really was. Contrary to waiting, they don't feed we for two generations. Because the twist, when they begin twist with country in history, it become worse after they overthrow more. So that was 30 years ago, then they overthrow former president Momo. Now, because that year he has been overthrown nowadays. So. And you now agree with me, say some post in there right now, we in Mama Sef we born her. No, me don't burn yet. They tell me they overthrow Momo. Because if you old, Lord will say 15 years now, you Mama we born you, in Sef, say me old around 15 years. So, in no born yet, they tell me they overthrow Momo. So lots of first-time voters them. Now two generations of propaganda against the APC and against President Momo. Nine they don't push pan them. So it's not for easy for make them understand how much they don't twist with nation in history. Past you get for patience, they take you time and they explain to people them for understanding issues then yeah. Which is one of the things we I don't effectively do over the past one year and more. And today, I want to highlight an effective leadership where President Momo may provide to this country. But by doing that, I they go first to the APC current constitution. Now we get the constitution where I hope to know me don't fenam by this time because I mean say let people then fenam. I want me to turn to the very first page of the constitution, the current 1995 constitution of Sierra Leone. And the very first cyber open am is start off by what he call if we get an open front now. When I go see something we then call the preamble. Preamble. Now that preamble, then now they can look today. Now the preamble, tell you inside Creo, what's in the inside there. The preamble starts off by saying that then soldier, the junta, the MPRC military junta, women don't ban political party na salon say now na soja rule nine for day that junta they don't talk now say make political party then come back for can contest elections and we may go on party we may name apc party but because the military may don't stop this party now for function so the party no may the function we need APC. So now this party we mean APC, since the military then so German and don't say now make party then begin function back and ready for contest elections back. This party we mean APC, the people that we get them, they want for can revive this party, they want to start this party back again. Then say but, now the preamble still had to continue for read for now so. Then say but, this party, right now, the country in present political experience, it get problem. It get challenge. So, because of that, the APC party, need for create a temporary constitution for fit with this present problem how the country did the country in political experience this now 1995 whether tending a rebel and they control most of kailan most of pujong parts of kenema huge chunk of sierra leone that tending 
rebel they control them and even the highways they road them for them like then rutile kono kailaun pujaun they highway then they they all now rebel and they control them so it means to say it's not easy for political party for function how it's supposed for function because now that's the mean by way they say the present political experience of the country. Well, now, now listen, the very interesting side, we, now from there, they pick up and carry on going out to the greatness of President Momo, where some people then can like for make, like this man also be a great man. So anyway, still under that preamble of the APC Constitution, he say, and this slide is enforced inside English, then that they can't talk inside Creole. He said, whereas the delegates of the erstwhile All People's Congress Party did on the 5th October 1991 adopt a revised constitution. And they read them out again in English. Whereas the delegates of the erstwhile All People's Congress Party did on the 5th October 1991 adopt a revised constitution. Now let's talk inside Creole. The right say this APC party, the delegates them of the APC party, October 5, 1991, they may not adopt a constitution where they revise. We are in the correct constitution of the APC. Let's talk and back inside Creole. This constitution they talk say delegates of APC October 5, 1991 they may adopt a revised constitution and the preamble will continue back for say. He said this recent experience of the people of Sierra Leone, that now this war, this war where may they be, the way how the country they. He said it don't make them imperative, say for reconstruct a temporary APC constitution. Make a talk and back. When I listen to me people then. He said because of the recent experience that's not the war, the way the country mix up, you know, they able to travel by road, all side confused, rebel the whole huge parts of the country. He said because of that recent experience day, even though we get the correct constitution for the APC, when not the October 5, 1991 constitution, he said, because of how the country they right now, we they can create a temporary constitution. An interim constitution. That means to say a constitution way now for manage no more for this circumstance who they so. But the correct constitution, now that October 5, 1991 constitution, now in the correct constitution. He said, because of this circumstance now, we don't happen inside this country right now. He said, therefore, the balance founding members of the APC will still exist. We they can now for present to the Electoral Commission this temporary interim constitution where we don't agree say now for use for this election where they come. 
I go read that part the back inside English. He said, now therefore, the founding members of the All People's Congress Party, APC, hereby on the fifth day of December 1995, adopt this present revised interim constitution as amended and ratified. Now, me people then, when I lock the constitution of the APC now, lock and discuss. When I see what I read out so to una, I just don't inform when I say, this 1995 constitution of the APC, when I one of the things the way they are caught right now, not to any kind sober or permanent constitutional I hope you understand what I just talk. This 1995 constitution, not to any kind sober or permanent constitutional, na a temporary interim constitution where for only act for that time where the country they can mix up political experience. The road the rebel Olam, the district the rebel outside them, the country not safe. So they mean get for choose this temporary interim constitution. The real constitution of the APC, ladies and gentlemen, the real constitution of the APC. I repeat tonight that the real constitution of the APC, when I imbind the APC right now, legally, I imbind the APC, not to the 1995 constitution, not at all. That 1995 constitution, we get a book who select or elect, select or elect, select, that constitution, they, now an interim temporary Constitution were not valid outside of the special circumstances where women get 1995. And they now tell Una, say, the only correct constitution of the All People's Congress now the 5th October 1991 Constitution. And that 5th October 1991 constitution, now the constitution where the APC choose under the leadership of President Joseph Saidu Momo, immediately after he passed the 1991 constitution of Sierra Leone. And me people, President Momo passed the 1991 constitution as a great leader when we believe in democracy, as a great man, as a patriot when we believe that the voice of the people is the voice of God. And not the voice of the leader is the voice of God. Waiting President Momo passed now the 1991 Sierra Leone Constitution is that no political party not for exist in Sierra Leone unless the internal arrangement of that party is democratically operated. So based on that, President Momo lead the APC as the great leader he was. He lead the APC four days after the Sierra Leone Constitution was enacted. The great President Joseph Saidu Momo lead the APC for create a 1991 constitution that was democratic and that constitution is the correct constitution of the APC. The 1995 constitution 
na a temporary constitution when the sojourn them they don't take over and pull this country pata pata so when no mean they for make we elect people them nas for example i go elect the kailan district chairman where kailan a rebel and did I go elect the corner district chairman where the road for Runa corner rebel and control the road. So it was not possible. So now that made them create the temporary 1995 constitution. And because, now I mean, just a temporary interim arrangement for fit into that circumstances for me to go able to contest the 1996 elections, he give powers them where under normal circumstances under the 1991 constitution, those powers would be against the constitution of Sierra Leone. It means now only the 1991 constitution of the APC, now invalid right now. Now my people to the next question. If indeed the APC gets such a beautiful legacy of having a past APC leader in the person of President Joseph Saidu Momo, who was such a great man that he makes sure say on the 5th of October 1991, the APC has a democratic constitution where they bind we all inside the APC. The question to be asked is, where the constitution day? Where we 1991 constitution? Where we 5th October 1991 constitution? Who side then don't hide them? Who that hide them? Why the person hide them? Why this person they give with party bad name? Select, 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 select or elect. When nothing like that, no day, na the real APC constitution. Why then they make this merry go round? Where all they need for do, na for ask Pa Usman Yansane, the former personal assistant to His Excellency President Joseph Saidu Momo, for ask Usman Yansane, say like pool with 1991 constitution. Ask H.E. and S. Baikuma, say like pool with 1991 constitution. We want for Siam. And if they not pull them, then it means to say, Usman for the Yansane and Anes Baikuma, then they on an agenda for pull the APC in name, like for say the APC in a party when not get democratic credentials in the history. When if you produce the October 5, 1991 constitution, you go immediately see say the APC is a very democratic party in its internal arrangements. And the 1995 constitution was just a temporary, temporary, temporary interim document of no moment right now, of no weight, and they should never have allowed us for continue forget the bad name we they get say we party not democratic. So tonight, at the call of all APC comrades, stand up and ask Usman for the Yansane and Anes Baikoma for produce the 5th October 1991 constitution. That is the correct constitution of the APC. It is democratic. It calls for elections and it has everything that makes us be in line with section 35 of the Sierra Leone constitution. Are they call on Una for call on them two people here because they all two get them and no say they get them. Are they confirm until they say they get them? Are they confirm until they say they not only get them but then they hide them? And are they confirm and say why then they hide them is because they want to use excessive powers 
that is in the temporary interim 1995 constitution. And every APC comrade should now stand up and say, we want the President Joseph Saidu Momo democratic constitution of October 5, 1991. On that note there, I will tell we all thank you. We don't day up this late for listening to me. And as I can always do, when I end my broadcast, I will end with the national anthem. I they play the tune of the national anthem. For me, when I reflect on the words now in our minds, waiting with the say, we will sing the national anthem. Waiting we mean, we will sing about the land that we love, our Sierra Leone. Let God bless you all. Amen. <laughs>